Troubleshooting your Whirlpool refrigerator. Hello everyone. Today, we're going to discuss what you can do if resetting your Whirlpool refrigerator doesn't resolve the problem. Remember, there's no need to panic. We're here to guide you step by step. Let's dive into some practical troubleshooting steps to get your refrigerator back on track. Is the power source the issue? Before delving deeper into the appliance itself, let's ensure it's not an external power issue. Check the power outlet. Plug another appliance into the same outlet to ensure it's working properly. Inspect the power cord. Sometimes, damage to the cord can interrupt the fridge's operation. Check your home circuit breaker. It might have tripped, cutting off power to the refrigerator. Are there any noticeable sounds or noises? Abnormal noises can give clues about where the problem might be. Buzzing or humming could point to a compressor or fan motor issue. Clicking sounds might indicate a start relay problem. If there's no sound at all, even when doors are open, there might be a more significant power or electrical issue. Is the temperature setting correct? Ensure that both the freezer and refrigerator sections are set to their recommended temperatures. If you've accidentally set the temperature too high or low, it can affect the refrigerator's performance. Adjust the settings and wait for a few hours to see if there's any improvement. Are there any visible signs of malfunction? Inspect the interior and exterior of the appliance. Check for frost buildup in the freezer. This could indicate a defrost system problem. Ensure that the door seals are intact and clean. Damaged seals can cause cooling inefficiencies. Check if the vents inside the fridge are blocked. This can disrupt airflow and affect temperature consistency. When to call a professional? If you've gone through all the steps and the problem persists, it might be time to consult with a professional. Complex electrical issues, refrigerant leaks, or compressor failures are not DIY-friendly tasks. Remember, it's always safer and often more cost-effective in the long run to get expert assistance for intricate repairs. We hope these steps help you identify the issue with your Whirlpool refrigerator. If you're ever in doubt, don't hesitate to call a professional technician. Thanks for joining us, and we wish you the best in getting your refrigerator up and running smoothly.